So we pass a little resting view spot. And look at this terrace ridge. Trail. There's a little run around the inlet. Dada sign. Mallard courtship. We will draw the curtain on that encounter in due deference to their need for privacy. Distant groan of highway from the Spalding, incrementally notches its volume up a bit. Know, it looks like we've got some daylily iris family things going on. Just a simple side trail, or is it? Ooh, look at this! Is the first time I've seen one of these. Some kind of yellow blaze. One can only guess at its import. Yeah, I think I'll follow this thing out to the highway, and I'll examine the main trunk on the way back. Up with here. 
Oh yes, it's another one of these makeshift bridge thingies. It ain't like in Andover where they love making stuff, but they do indicate their fondness for it all by dumping a few branches in to make a passage. <laughs> oh yeah, this is a cool trail. Oh, there appears to be some sort of key. A, E, and then A. It's like a note more than anything. What could it be? It does skirt the other side of the inlet. Oh, here's some rising ferns. Already filling out a bit. A lot of winter fall damage. Oh boy, look at all that pine. Know, let's see what this quirky little sign tells us. <laughs> oh, I see, it's just people having fun with a Sharpie. Nothing noteworthy here. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool, though. All you really need to know is yellow. such vast thing off in the distance a mile and a half of trail is supported by Liberty Mutual and something called measured progress
I'm imagining this is some kind of secondary trail. Although it may be the official Dover Community Trail, it would be nice if it was. Quite a bit of river view here. It's pretty wide too. A little wind picking up. Your back room almost. <laughs> Old farm fields. Some marsh formation on the back of a sandbar, probably. of as yet unmelted snow clinging. like favorable New England cottontail habitat. Looks like there's even some effort to create the characteristic brush piles you want to make to give them fortresses. 